Hello friends, we're here on top of the Burlington Science Center to introduce to you an incredible scientific tool that we call a weather station. A weather station is actually a bunch of science tools all put together to help scientists who study the weather, known as meteorologists, measure the weather conditions right now. When we look at the weather station, we can see a lot of tools at work as we speak. Here on the very top, we have a wind vane and an anemometer. The anemometer records how fast the wind is blowing by catching the force of the wind as the air passes by. The stronger the force of the wind, the more the cups rotate like a pinwheel. The weather station uses math to calculate how fast the wind is blowing by how many times the cups spin around. The weather vane tells us what direction the wind is blowing as the wind pushes the weather vane's tail in line with the direction the air flows. Up here we have a rain gauge. This bowl collects rainfall and directs the water down this little hole where the weather station measures how much rain has fallen and then dumps the water out underneath. There are also some important weather tools that can't be seen but are hidden inside the weather station. There is a thermometer used to measure how warm or cold the temperature of the air is and a barometer which measures the weight of the air above us known as air pressure. Our weather station also has a little wireless antenna that sends its signal to the science center so that we can read the information the weather station is picking up. Inside, our weather station monitor receives the signal and displays the information. The weather station monitor also sends its signal to the internet so people all over the world can observe the weather conditions directly above the science center. With such a cool tool at your fingertips, I can't wait to see how you'll use the science center weather station's data. What can you learn about the weather from the science center's weather station? How can you study our climate with the help of our weather station's data? Whatever you do, the Science Center is looking forward to exploring with you.